to make the lives of our friends in the Caribbean as convenient and efficient as ours, the Taiwan ICDF has started to bring many information and communications technologies to these countries in recent years. By doing so, we enhance the level of digitalization and build the foundations for smart cities in our Caribbean partner countries. In St. Vincent and the Grenadines, buses are the main form of public transportation for the local people. Due to the lack of regulation, routes and hours of operation vary for every individual driver. This means that waiting for a bus becomes a time-consuming and trivial pursuit. Moreover, drivers tend to compete for passengers often stopping at will, making the intersections more dangerous for all road users. To improve their traffic conditions, the Taiwan ICDF is cooperating with the St. Vincent and Grenadines government to implement the smart bus system from Taiwan in the hope of improving public transport in St. Vincent and the Grenadines. St. Kitts and Nevis, one of Taiwan's partner countries in the Caribbean, still deals with document management manually in hospitals, which makes it inconvenient for people to get medical treatment and reduces the efficiency of medical staff. To help our partner countries effectively improve their current situation, the Taiwan ICDF uses the technology that we have accumulated over years of developing hospital information system for local hospitals to enhance the efficiency of medical management and reduce the waiting times of the public. To revitalize land use and boost economic development, the government of St. Kitts and Nevis has been promoting the new land registry bill since 2016 as a basis for improving the efficiency of land administration and hopes to reference the Taiwan experience in order to boost administrative efficiency. Another partner of Taiwan in the Caribbean, St. Lucia, is facing the problem of the digital gap. Thus, the government that aims to increase informatization at all levels with smart education as a priority goal. An important part of promoting smart education is the use of information and communications technology to support teaching. Compared to Taiwan, the teachers of St. Lucia they are generally unskilled in the creation of digital materials. With Taiwan's experience in campus development, the Taiwan ICDF hopes to help teachers in St. Lucia enhance their information and communications technology capabilities. In addition to the aforementioned projects, the Taiwan ICDF has also attached great importance to the promotion of smart agriculture in recent years and has promoted related projects in various countries. For example, the Agricultural Adaptation Capacity Enhancement Project in St. Kitts and Nevis, which collects climate data through a newly established agricultural weather station, aims to enhance farmers' ability to respond to climate change and reduce damages with the help of early warnings of extreme weather events. Through these efforts utilizing our rich information and communications technology and experience, the Taiwan ICDF has laid a solid foundation 
for our vision of building smart homelands with our partner countries in the Caribbean. The Taiwan ICDF will continue to work with our partner countries to build smart and resilient cities and a sustainable living environment for all their people.